Hey guys, thank y'all for getting to this video. In this video, I'm just gonna show you how to start an online store without using Shopify. And you guys, you can sell anything, imagine, um, just like nothing illegal, but anything that you want to start a business, um, some start some online to make some side money. Um, this is the video you want to check out. So I'm gonna just show you. This is not gonna really cost you much money. You may need uh, maybe a hundred or two hundred dollars, but um you can actually do this for free also so i'm gonna show you kind of like both ways to how how to go with it um just in case if you don't have money or you roll running low on funds and you still want to uh open up a store and make some money so this is what we're gonna go ahead and do and get started so i really just got like five steps that you need to do um these five steps are very simple um self-explanatory and i'm gonna go into it with you in depth um, and show you which ones I use and how to go about doing it so your first step is going to usually be I always tell people man you got to have a merchant account you got to have somewhere to put your money got to have somewhere so they can um, process the transaction so I recommend you guys get uh, a merchant account or get a bank account and you can also start a business a LLC if you like to that's not necessary but it depends on how long you think you want to be in this business because a, a lot of tax um, benefits from starting a business so these are some things you want to look at you don't necessarily have to start a business but you gotta at least have a bank account and an online merchant account and we'll get to that in a second but uh, the second step you will need to do you have to have that product whatever product you have um, you need to be firm with it I usually say pick a product that's um, identify with you um, something that you're comfortable with if it's something that you like have on a daily basis or something that you wear or something that you use on a daily basis that'd be a good good somewhere to start and make sure you have a budget as well um, you know a lot of people are pretty much kind of low not saying low on funds but doesn't have a lot of money to invest so just figure out that number that number could be anything it could be a thousand dollars it could be a hundred dollars it could be 50 bucks whatever that budget is um, have that budget and think about in the future like a monthly budget because you might need that as well to um, ultimately scale your business so once you find all that the third step you're going to need to get a website um, get your social media together um, and of course create a, a phone number and an email address for this business for whatever business store you want to open you must uh, create that phone number and that email address so people can get in contact with you um, because you probably be the customer service rep as well so that's something you got to look at you got to get a website you got to get a um, some type of seller site as well uh, something that's going to help promote um, and get the message out there um, so that's that's one thing you need to set up and the fourth step you're probably just going to need to get some pictures um, you gotta have to get some scripts ready so you can post your product um, get your videos if you want to run videos um, you gotta um, and this is another thing where social media come in hand um, you're gonna need to set up these sites so you can have somewhere to put your your content or to uh, share your store out to um, but videos are good you're gonna need some videos you definitely gonna have to have some posts posts is ready and plenty uh, take plenty, plenty of pictures uh, uh, when you want to start when you get going and the fifth step is just you know we basically just gonna repeat the process and of course just reinvest your money stay consistent and the number one thing is never lower your price so whatever your price is guys never lower it I don't care if a thousand people say that um, it's too high um, never lower it um, because they're just saying that you're lowering your standards and we don't want that we want you to get the um, max amount of money you can get so I ain't saying overcharge people but stay firm whatever your number is um, try not to get too many discounts discounts are good but let's try not to do too many so let's go ahead and get started I'm gonna show you exactly which ones I use and how I go about um, doing my social media finding posts what product and um and how to um basically get the most out of this store without using Shopify. So let's go and get to it. Okay, like I said, the first thing I will want somebody to go do is to get you a bank account. Um, but you can't get a Wells Fargo or Chase Bank or 
any other national bank. If you can't get one of those bank accounts, um, get you a Chime account. Chime is free to sign up. Uh, it's not going to cost you nothing. They're not going to charge you nothing. But uh, you're definitely going to need somewhere to uh, basically keep your money or house your money once you start making um, commissions off your items. So Chime, um, you can just type in Chime.com. I actually got a link below. You can actually get $50 if you set up a direct deposit. So if you got a job, if you set up your direct deposit, they'll give you an extra $50. And you can actually use that $50 to uh, help run your business. So, But this is a good one to um, get but make sure you have that bank account all right this site right here is called stripe stripe is just a merchant account remember i was telling about merchants accounts as well we needed a bank account but we also needed a merchant account so our merchants account is going to be to a point where we can accept online um sales where we can accept money online so we just set these little things up you can either get stripe or paypal y'all familiar with paypal um, you got to have a PayPal account. I suggest you get the business account, but you can use the personal as well. But if you got a business, set your business account up. But you have to get one of these merchants. Um, I actually use both. I actually like uh, Stripe a little bit better than um, PayPal, but they both work perfectly. Um, set one of these up. They're basically uh, self explanatory. Like you said, guys, you don't need no money to sign up for this stuff. Um, just, just pick one and you'll get all set up and then we can move on to the next step all right step two you guys you want to find your product with finding your product you can basically like i said you can sell anything that you want to sell but you got to have like a wholesale site to get it from and i recommend dhgate.com or aliexpress because their products are cheap um they don't cost much um <laughs> and you can buy a lot of it for your book um, especially if you got some money I can show you what to do if you don't have any money but if you got a little money to buy bulk um, please go buy it and with DH gate I want and get like high-end stuff so I want to get like you no know, Nikes off here I want to get you no know, t-shirts but I will get like toys um, maybe a little accessories um, I wouldn't be I, definitely toys stuff for the kids something real small uh, I definitely don't like the clothes on here maybe some puzzles whatever you want to sell I, I wouldn't do I could do watches you could do some watches um, hair uh, they got some good vendors on hair if you want to do hair I know a couple of people that use DH gate um, for like their hair business so you want to start a hair business they have some good vendors on here but you're gonna have to sift and sort through um they just as good but come get you a, um some products whatever product you is go ahead grab it and um order it same thing with aliexpress if you like using aliexpress come over here now if you were part of my team and got one of my trainings um I actually provide a list of um vendors that you can use um at wholesale um you can get a lot of products um they definitely work good but only catch with this um you definitely have to sign up with the company and just you know you just have to go through the little process but they definitely have great discounts on stuff and i have that list available if you want it uh if you want it just hit me up um and we can discuss what what, what we can do with it but you guys get you a product get you a product and if you don't have no money for a product you can always come you come over here to walmart um and you want to go to and you can do um target anything that do like next day shipping that's what you want to do next day shipping or pickup um so let's just say if you want to start selling uh last thing i looked at with tvs if you want to start selling tvs um you can buy them super cheap uh we can actually come down here i think it says something like clearance rollback prices come to rollback and you want to do see all these have rolled back a little bit and eligible for next day uh you guys <laughs> so you can actually when when you want to do stuff like this you can just come in here just take the pictures post it on your website and then when somebody purchase on it, um, you can just buy it with their money and ship it to them. You know, that's who you want to get the free money. Then just, I don't want to get 
deep into it uh, because this video probably going to be, I'm trying to keep the video short, but you see the GIF, people, a 24-inch, less than $100. You could sell it for, I don't know, let's just see. Walmart won $48 for it. Let's just look and just see what uh, the average price is for this. Let's see. I'm just going to cost us. You see, everybody still want 100 and something dollars for it. So you can sell it 100 and make like 20 bucks off of it. But you never owned it. You see right here, got the same 100. <laughs> so, you guys, you can make some money off of it just for free. All you got to do is just take the pictures, post it on your website, share your website. and uh, But you got to have a product. Go get your product. Like I said, I recommend AliExpress or um, DHgate. And if you're doing the free version, uh, you could do Walmart. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. All right, guys. Now for the third step is you want to go get that website. Uh, I recommend Weebly.com. Um, it's definitely the best one I have seen out here outside of Shopify. Um, this is a free. You can actually set it up for free. Uh, they got all the templates for you. Drag, uh, drag and drop. Only thing you got to do is just put in your information and um, figure out what kind of colors you want. But this, if you even if you have any problems, I will leave a um, a link below of how to set up a website on Wibbly and, and how to make it look cool, especially an e-commerce account. But once you do, once you set it up, you do want to um, make it like an online store. You want to do an e-commerce store, so you can get all the benefits and stuff that comes with the. Uh, with the website building um, for Wibbly, and it's simple to set up, you guys. It ain't gonna cost you nothing. This is what I use, and you can actually integrate your PayPal and Stripe account to it as well. And also, with that being said, you guys create a new email address. Get you a new email address for this business, so you can keep up with all your information and all the stuff that you need um, going forward with making this store. Um, make that email address, of course, um, your brand name or whatever your brand is, and um, keep it like that. And get you a phone number, get you a Google Voice number. Um, Google still have Google Voice numbers. Let's see. Get you a Google Voice number. Um, it's still the same. Uh, I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure it's free to set up as well. Um, you see, it's just log me and mine. Um, it's still, I don't use it as much, but you see, guys, just get your free. Um, phone number from Google um, and then um, have that as well put that on your site and get that going um, because you're definitely going to need that as well uh, you might be like you said you might be your own customer service so if somebody have a problem or issue they can call somebody and get in contact with them you can get in, they can get in contact with you and y'all can resolve an issue if it is an issue or not uh, but definitely get those um, it's definitely free but make sure you get this website Watch the video in the description to see how to set one up real good. And let's move on to the next step. All right, guys, for the fourth step, you want to come get your Facebook account. I know a lot of people have Facebook accounts because a billion people have it. And <laughs> I'm pretty sure you're one of those billion people. So um, with your Facebook page, you want to create uh, um, a, a fan page or a business page for your product and for your store. Of course, name it the same thing. Come over here, just click start and put your business name and your uh, category that you, you're in. And you're going to be able to um, get your message out there a lot broader when using Facebook because now you can actually run ads. You don't have to run ads, but to get in the business account, you want to be able to run ads. Like I said, uh, we're starting this. You don't need as much money, but you're still going to need some money. But not as much as you need with messing with Shopify, because Shopify is like $30-something dollars starting off. And, of course, you're still going to need extra stuff to plug in, website name, and a lot of other stuff that ultimately is going to leave you out the pocket around about $200 a month. But with this, it's probably just going to be a $200 one-time fee. And, of course, you just have a little advertising budget just so we can get your business out there a lot better broader because once you get a facebook um fan page you can get your message you can run one ad for five dollars and reach about what about ten thousand people or maybe a thousand people for five dollars ten dollars maybe maybe you can reach 
uh, maybe two or three, four thousand like that. But it's just pennies that you can reach a lot of people with just so little money. So you're definitely going to need a Facebook fan page. Uh, if you don't know how to set one up, there's a link in the description that will help you set one up to get it going and get it running like a, a basically an online store. So another thing, if you don't, um, if you got a little money and you don't want to do all this stuff, you can actually just come over here to Fiverr. I don't know if you are familiar with Fiverr.com. You come over here to Fiverr.com, and Fiverr.com can actually set up your whole online store for you for the low. <laughs> so, like you said, you you don't have to spend all this money just to keep your store up and running and get it looking good, man. You come over here and pay somebody five dollars for a logo, five dollars for a website, five dollars for um, your Facebook, your your social media pages, and that's twenty dollars. And now you got a business set up, and they just did the same steps that I just showed you. Just get your merchant account. Well, of course you already have that, but get get your website going. Get whatever products you need. They actually have. Um, let just show you. Uh, e-commerce. Oh, there you go. E-commerce website. Now you click on here. You see they all range from a hundred dollars. They'll create a, uh, a Shopify store, but you won't want to create on Weebly because Shopify you gotta really pay. So let's just say. On the keywords and let's see what pops up ah you see this see it right here I will make an e-commerce Webly website for you for five dollars so you guys there's no excuse to get that website up and going and then once you get that website and get your Facebook page ready and everything set now you are ready to post you gotta post everywhere um, especially if you don't got no money for an ad you like I said you come over here and do um, Facebook ads and we want to look of course you can come over here if you got some money of course spending on some good good people uh, everybody pretty much good on here but we want to go to the lowest one five dollars cuz we on a budget max is five dollars for a Facebook ad bam see that I would create uh nah I'll create a Facebook cover. We'll design an amazing Facebook ad banner. Uh we'll set up and manage your ad campaign. We'll design Facebook covers. But you can come over here, you see what I'm saying? You can come over here and get you an ad picture. I will design a professional Facebook ad or Instagram ad for five dollars. You guys, you see? For ten dollars. I got a website and I got an ad to run for my business so you, you see what I'm saying you gotta have a little money not much just a little so uh, basically just keep that in mind for Fiverr Fiverr could do a lot of work for you but or you could do it for free it doesn't matter if you want to go the free route you can so if you want to uh, post um, for free and try to get more uh, people um, you actually just can come over here to groups come into groups um, there's a lot of groups on here as well probably a billion groups but you just come over here and search the category that you your niche that is that you're in so uh let's say you're in the fishing niche let's say fishing we're in the fishing niche, and we come over here we just type in fishing then we just go to groups and you just add all these groups uh we'll add the ones that get a lot of engagement uh, or a lot of posters a day and make sure they have like you know a lot of people in this group a lot of people in the group so you can your uh, product can be shown to a lot of people and you just keep sharing in these groups um, cause especially if you selling fishing rods man and you get a, a fishing rod from DH gate for the low and come in here and start selling them you know put them on your website and start sharing your website Say you got a discount, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But you're not giving a discount. So um, it's a lot of stuff you can do with this, people. So I just gave you the uh, just the basics and simple where it's like you can do this without 
a Shopify store. A lot of people try to run the Shopify, spend all this money and not make no money. Well, I just show you how to just set it up all for free and just put in the work and see if it's something for you. See if you'll be able to sell because if you can set, you can actually sell a lot of stuff from these free methods. And once you get it going, then you can reinvest and um, keep reinvesting so you can get uh, more product or a better looking website and better ads, run ads and see. Um, Get your product out to more people, like you said, and never lower your price. Whatever your price is, never lower it. And then also another cool thing, you can come over here to Facebook Marketplace. I forgot about that. You can post your product in Facebook Marketplace um, just as good. Like you said, it's all free. I use Facebook. Facebook is like the streets. <laughs> it's like the, the mall. It's like where everybody's at, um, hanging at, hanging out at. And a lot of people got money on here, um, and it's proven. Um, and w once we recap the steps, um, the first step, like you said, man, just get you that merchant account, get your bank account, um, and you can start your business. Uh, make sure you get your brand name and everything, but make sure you have that set up and ready to go. Um, next is just find your product and get your budget ready, whatever product you want to sell. Like I said, make it something that sh that you use, that you use, and something that you're proud of, or something that you like, your niche, something that ident identifies with you. And of course, make your budget, or whatever you're trying to spend a month, or even just to get started buying products or whatever. Like I said, it could be no money, or just if you have a budget, uh, make sure you have that in mind. And then after that, of course, um, build your website, or go get one made. Set up your social media, of course, not just Facebook, use Instagram as well, and Twitter, Pinterest. There's a lot of social media sites out here, but make sure you use all of them. Well, you ain't got to use all of them, but make sure you use the top few of them, like Facebook and Instagram. Um, and, of course, get your email address and a phone number. You can get all that stuff for free as well. And, of course, um, grab all your pictures and um, post, post um, everywhere. Like I said, you can go to Fiverr and get you some videos uh, or get your posts made and you start posting them on, you know, the Facebook groups or Facebook marketplace. Or you can run ads for your uh, product and send them straight to your website to purchase. Um, just that simple. And, of course, once you start making a little money or once you start making your first, even your first sale, I would recommend you reinvest that money into your business so it can keep growing and keep um, operating and of course stay consistent and never lower your price because um, you're not going to win if you look, keep lowering your prices so, so hopefully y'all find value in this video man and if you did find value in this video please give it a thumbs up if you didn't find value in this video please give it a thumbs up like share comment share with your team and I'll see y'all on the next video